Hi everyone, we're back again with Al Murray, and today we're checking out the video uh, Al Murray takes on the nations of the world. So it was highly requested by you guys, and uh, yeah. we truly uh, enjoyed his, you know, comedy skits. We loved Al Murray, and we loved you guys. And yeah. big shout out to you before we start. And are you ready? Man, yeah, we're gonna <laughs> take on the the, the nations. Yeah, it's a long video, and our coffee is ready. <laughs> we were gods, <laughs> and there she is at the top, in the middle of the map. At the top of the map. Doesn't get any better than that. She's beautiful, isn't she? Aye? The only actually sexually attractive com country on the map. Aye? Here, Ludwig, one look at her. Aye, she's beautiful, isn't she, mate? Aye? Mm, I can see why you lot wanted her so much. Ah, the point is... <laughs> Great Britain is, of course, the centre of the earth. That's a scientific fact. <laughs> it cannot be argued with. Straight through Great Britain runs the North Line of Longitude. Great Britain is scientifically, technically, provably the centre of the earth. Yeah? Because yeah, of the like long line the longitude. All right. The we put the line there, but it still stands. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what does that mean? Well, it means that we, the British, us in here, we're in charge of what time is all over the world. Yeah. <laughs> that, yep. oh, that, yeah. That's a fact. It means the Germans don't sit down for their lunch until we say it's one o'clock. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> How does he think of that? And we wrote a book, we did, and we wrote it in English, the finest language in the world, in fact, the finest language in the universe, a language even spoken in space, as any fan of Star Trek will tell you. A language... <laughs> <laughs> a language even Americans can handle with some degree of skill, though they're... With some degree of skill. needs a few lessons, mate. Now, you look at it. <laughs> Axel of Elvis, what's he on about? You look at this. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Which is beautiful, I mean... I mean, we invented work. We, the British, invented work. That is a fact. Yeah, we've done everything. Work. We invented work. We had a revolution, industrial revolution, invented work. The French didn't. They had a French revolution when they invented in French. <laughs> As a result, a lot of dead French people. <laughs> Polish, <laughs> Russians. <laughs> Ask any historian. The Russians, they had a similar revolution outcome. You know, we didn't bother with that. Yeah, we had an industrial revolution when we invented work. At no, the end yeah. of it, everyone had shoes, a knife and a fork, and a giant fucking metal ship each. You can't argue with that. <laughs> That's why we, the British, are currently entitled to have our feet up and have whatever we want made by a Malaysian four-year-old for a pound. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you and I earned that. We should make the most of it. Now. <laughs> yeah, and it's a broad church, Great Britain. We've got the Scots, we've got the Jocks, of course, and I love you, Jocks. You're beautiful people. Jocks? Yeah, yeah. I love you. You're beautiful. And it's, you, Jocks, you like to say, don't you, Paul? You like to say, ah, the Battle of Bannockburn. Nay, nay, the Battle of Bannockburn. Nay, when the field ran red with English blood, when Robert the Bruce told the English indeed, a lesson he would never forget. Fair play. Got to give it to you on that one. Whoa. You want it fair and square. <laughs> no, okay. I got it. Okay. I literally I got know. nothing. <laughs> okay, maybe he's um, he's imitating the way they speak. Yeah, I know, but I mean, I couldn't uh, even the Scotland? catch anything. What did you say? The uh, yeah. jokes? Okay, I don't know. Yeah, the whole I don't know what you're talking. Okay, okay. Did you were you able to catch any of them? I know like, the jokes like, somewhere like, I, 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 in my field of work. Somewhere. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, <laughs> fair play. Got to give it to you on that one. You want it fair and square. But you say Bannockburn, I say Culloden, because it's not the heats that count, is it, mate? It's the final. <laughs> As far as I remember, you, you lot have never actually been in the final, have you? Now, look at this. Look no. at this. Our Celtic brethren, the Welsh, and I love the Welsh. They're beautiful people, aren't they? God bless the Welsh. Hey, and what's interesting about the Welsh is it said they have an accent. I don't think they do. I think they have an attitude, with all due respect. <laughs> <laughs> Every time a Welsh bloke opens his mouth, he sounds as though he's dying of some inner fucking hurt and torment that he hasn't figured out yet. <laughs> Whatever it is, even on his wedding day, the happiest day of his life, he sounds pissed off, doesn't he? This is the happiest day of my life! I cannot wait to spend the rest of my life with you, the most beautiful woman I have ever seen. <laughs> In Cardiff. <laughs> In Cardiff. Why won't you stop raining now? Next door. There's our cheeky sidekick, Ireland, of course. Why? Okay. Why? 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 <laughs> oh, they've changed the name, paint a different colour, but we're the ones with the fucking engine. You look at it. Oi! Oi! No! 
I'll be the oh. first to admit it's been a bumpy ride with the Irish. It's not always gone according to plan. And even when it has gone according to plan, they haven't liked that either, have they? Leading to long, expensive judicial inquiries. But... <laughs> <it's> all... <laughs> There's a lot went wrong. I mean, that potato family yeah, was a terrible family business. But you can get crisps for love nor money in this country. <laughs> <laughs> That's when we first turned to peanuts in my business. Now, <laughs> <laughs> got to keep the punters thirsty somehow. <laughs> but I love the Irish and I have infinite respect for them up to a point because over many years. <laughs> How do you have infinite respect up to a point? <laughs> <laughs> well, I love the Irish and I have infinite respect for them up to a point because over many years. <laughs> Over many years, they've done much for us, haven't they? They, they? they dug our roads and now they sing for our amusement. It's fantastic. <laughs> 20 years ago, Westlife would have been digging the M25. There's no doubt about that. <laughs> God, we believe I can fly. Yeah, all right. Is it there? I didn't That's know they were there. Uh... <laughs> they've done well for a bunch of tone-deaf, spud-faced chances. <laughs> <laughs> Next, of course, we have the neighbour from hell. That's... <clears throat> I don't know why we why? don't destroy a great big hedge up the English Channel. <laughs> why do, why do you that really hey. does he hate that? <laughs> big noisy party in Kent. Chuck some dog shit over the fence. Hey! <laughs> Set fire to a few tyres. Hey! <laughs> that would be the way to go. France, or the France, as it prefers to call itself. The La, France. France. Yeah. La, La France. France. The France. In case we should confuse it with some other France. <laughs> <laughs> this France, or that France, or courageous, reliable, turning up in times of battle France. Or... <laughs> 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 you work your way down, there's the unsolved Rubik's Cube of Europe there. Spain and Portugal, as you can see. Why? You can't get them last two bricks. Now... Uh, <laughs> who has been to Spain? How Shut did you think of that, really? Everybody, basically. Reese of this, Battle Armada, 1588, we defeated the Spanish. As a result, they signed a humiliating treaty allowing our boys and girls to go and fight on their beaches. Of course... What, what, <laughs> We've got to stay match fit somehow. Now, <laughs> this had the added bonus of the Spanish trying to think we're poised, ready to invade the following morning once our heads have cleared and we've stopped copulating like eels. I'll tell you what, <laughs> what goes on in Spain is filthy, isn't it, Annie? It's filthy, isn't it, love? <laughs> filthy, isn't it? Filthy. filthy. <laughs> Say it, love. Filthy. Yeah, of course, filthy, like that. <laughs> filthy. Filthy. <laughs> filthy. <laughs> 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 Look at him. <laughs> no, she cannot do that. No one can do that. Fantastic. <laughs> 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 little Canadian friend, you say filthy now as well. Go and say filthy. Filthy. <laughs> yeah, how about you Canadian. two look at each other and say filthy? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, girls. Come on. <laughs> Come on. You might enjoy it. You never know. It could be the beginning of something very interesting. Come on. <laughs> Oh my God! Did you see what he did right here? He, he held the globe right here. <laughs> no wait! <age. laughs> <laughs> I knew it. I know where he was going with oh, that. That's fantastic. Well, that's every man's dream, isn't it? The chance to disappoint two women at once. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, love. I'm puffed out for the first one. Oh, nah. my oh, job. Yes. Look at this. <laughs> and the whole thing with Spain. Right, this is a great place to go on holiday because it's extremely hot, right? Yeah, in fact, it's so hot you can't think, innit? You get off the plane, you can't even fucking think your way down at the end of the stairs. You have a couple of beers, you wipe your own memory. It's the perfect place to go and get away from everything because you can't think, you can't remember anything. Fucking brilliant. <laughs> now, that's fine for us. Going there for two weeks, a week, weekend, whatever. Yeah, for the British to get away from it all, go to a country where it's too hot to think. But for the people actually living there, it's caused all sorts of problems. <laughs> the Spanish, I mean, they have that lie down in the afternoon to try and clear their heads and make some decisions in the evening. But <laughs> it's played havoc with their decision making process, isn't it? For many centuries, they were convinced the earth was flat. I mean, for Christ's sake. <laughs> it's not even level, is it? It's ridiculous. <laughs> I mean, mountains are the clue, aren't they? Fuck it out. Hey, look around your cars. No. <laughs> they had to be, they had to be proved wrong by an Italian. That's how low they'd sunk. <laughs> then there's a. <laughs> That whole business oh. of fighting animals, bullfighting. Now, I have no row with a cow. I want no battle with cattle. It's not <laughs> personal, is it, the whole thing with a cow? We look at rear a cow and look after it for a couple of years and it turns itself into the abattoir. But it's not personal, is it? Right? It's a business arrangement. It's not personal. I wouldn't punch a cow in the face. It would be a humiliating thing to do to it on its way to its death. I wouldn't do that. Right? It would be unfair on the cow. It just so happens I'm hungry. He's made a beef. It's not personal, is it? <laughs> 
Oh, you see, I punch a squirrel if I could get close enough. Fuck <laughs> 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 you, you little bastard. Fuck off. Stop leaving nuts in the sand pit in the beer garden. But... In the beer garden? Oh, my God. <laughs> if I did punch a squirrel, I'd be doing it for myself. What? Well, out of curiosity or revenge. I wouldn't... OK. I wouldn't be doing it for the amusement of strangers in an arena. I wouldn't put on tights. <laughs> <laughs> Matador. We'll stick pins in the squirrel first <laughs> to enrage him. <laughs> I wouldn't wave a cape the colour squirrels don't like. Just, just probably a grey green like a rotten nut. I don't fucking know. It doesn't matter. I wouldn't do it. Oh. Normal. Uh, Ludwig, what's your animal size punching limit cut off? What's the biggest animal you'd punch, Ludwig? A kangaroo. For me, dog. A dog. Yeah, a dog. There's all sorts of. You're talking a Great Dane or a Terrier? What are we talking? Great Dane. You punch a Great Dane. <laughs> <laughs> that's you and the, that's the Germans all over it, the Danish. You're not happy with them, each other, are you? <laughs> <laughs> oh. The point is. We flipped the bone. The point is. This, <laughs> right, I mean, if you chucked a donkey off a church tower in Great Britain. <laughs> 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 yes, exactly. <laughs> If you chucked a donkey off a church tower in Great Britain, right? Yeah, you'd be on a register in about 15 minutes flat, wouldn't you? Big angry crowd of fat women in shell suits protesting at your doorstep. <laughs> Having brought their kids along without the going. faintest idea what's going on. <laughs> That's what, this country is normal. Now, nah. <laughs> work your way along, there's Italy. And I'd like to point out right now that this is, this is fact. There's no opinion in what's to follow. The basic thing with Italy, right, is they've got okay. no follow through, have they? You don't see stuff through to its logical. 43, they folded early. <laughs> they still haven't called a plumber. It's ridiculous, isn't it? <laughs> it's under them stairs. Yeah, do, it, fucking, do up the stopcock, for Christ's sake. Yeah, <laughs> Look, in any other are. country, a flooded they city that's tank of shit would be regarded as a disaster, wouldn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Look, some sort of romantic no jewel in a crown. <laughs> I mean, a pizza. What is a pizza? I tell you, it's a pasty that some arsehole hasn't shut yet, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> shut the pasty, Giuseppe! <laughs> oh, my okay, God. Okay, those because I ain't finished. Up here, we well, have okay. Germany. Now, I respect the Germans, I do, yeah, because they tried twice, didn't they? <laughs> Two cracks of the world title, you'll have to respect that. <laughs> <laughs> Swiss, there's course the plucky Swiss, Switzerland there. I mean, God bless the Swiss. I mean, look at the situation those people have got themselves into. Hey, look at it, hey? French to the right of them, yeah? Austrians to the left of them, Germans up above, Italians down below. Hey? Oh. You'd never sell that flat, would you? <laughs> <laughs> you wouldn't be able to shift it, no matter how tidy it was, how much chocolate you left lying around. This Austria, which is made of pastry, that's why it shrunk. You work your way down, you've got Yugoslavia. Now, basically, basically, I'll explain it for the MP. Basically, basically, Jane, the people who live in Yugoslavia don't really get on. That's all you need, though. Now, don't really get on. And a while ago, we, the British, bombed it, yeah? Because it's very complicated. We bombed it to make it simpler for them. But, um, <laughs> Can't argue about who lives where when there's no houses left, can you? Hey. Oh! No pleasing some people. Down here, Albania, where the Albinos live. You've got, uh, <laughs> Greece, where they invented the Olympics. Turkey, where they invented Christmas. I know which one I prefer. It comes around every year. It's Bulgaria, Turkey. Romania, Moldavia, the Womble... Wait, what? Turkey? Wait, Turkey? They, inv they invented Christmas? Why? Because, because of the stuffed turkey? <laughs> Could it, can you be played? <laughs> I don't know, yeah. They invented Christmas. I know which one I prefer. It comes around every year. It's Bulgaria, Romania, oh, Moldavia, yeah. the Womble countries. It's, uh... <laughs> Ukraine, the only country you can get the word urine out of in one go. There's Poland, <laughs> where everyone's a trained plumber. Lithuania, where they're all electricians. Estonia, where they're all uh, plasterers. And Latvia, where everyone's a carpenter coming over Is here and doing true? the jobs. We're not prepared <laughs> yeah, to do to all got worthless degrees in media studies. There's Sam. Um, <laughs> He's a search answer. I mean, look at, look at the size. When you look at the world from this angle, though, look at the size of Russia. Look at the size. Of, just look at the size of Russia. Annie, pop up, measure Russia, love. Come on, put a finger either end of Russia, sweetheart. That's it. Good girl. Your dreams are going to come true for you. That's it. For yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, do you see? Do you see exactly? Hold the fingers up. Show everyone exactly how big, how big, how big. Yes, you, you're getting the message yet, sweetheart. <laughs> There's a fine line between banter and harassment, isn't there? <laughs> Fucking European court. Now, <laughs> I mean, 
we rush this gigantic. As she goes all the way around to America. Yeah? Then you've got the international date line that we set up a while back. Some middle-aged men from Birmingham who meet and marry ladies from the Philippines. Okay. Then we have... <laughs> <laughs> The Pacific Rim, Andrew? Yeah, I got your number, pal. <laughs> Japan, of course, Korea. Well, 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 of course, the Korean War, that was a terrible business. Basically, we found out they were eating dogs and sent in the RSPCA rifles as quickly as we could. There's some... <laughs> China, where they put a man in space very recently. Mind you, they didn't use a rocket, they just stood on each other's shoulders and passed him up. <laughs> <laughs> Hence the leotard shortage two years ago. There's some... Um... <laughs> Mongolia, of course, we're not allowed to call it that anymore, eh? Fucking social workers. There's some... Um... Oh, my God. Same goes for the Black Sea. There's Kazakhstan, of course, where the Kazakhs live, Uzbekistan, where the Uzbekis live, Turkmenistan, where the Turkmenis live, <laughs> Tajikistan, where the Tajikis live, and Kazakhstan, where they take the fucking piss, to be honest. <laughs> and it goes all the way around to Europe, yeah? Russia's gigantic, a massive country, endless mineral resources, and a population used to doing exactly as they're told for tuppence. And it's still crap, they can't turn it around. And I think the simple reason for this is they need, and the only way they're going to fix it, they need to get in a proper working alphabet with actual letters that people can read. It's <laughs> <laughs> <To> nonsense. <laughs> Dingbats, what are they thinking? Down here, of course, Africa. <laughs> now, That's what they think. the man of science, yeah, like Ben here, the doctor, would tell us that all human life originally evolved in Africa. Would you say that? Absolutely. Absolutely. Well, I can't agree with you, mate. I was in Devon three weeks ago. <laughs> <laughs> Let me tell you this, natural selection's got some power lifting to do in Plymouth. <laughs> <laughs> no, natural selection. <laughs> no thumbs, tails, it's an outrage. <laughs> Cornwall is actually Celtic for cousin's wedding. And we have... <laughs> the Middle East. <laughs> Careful! <laughs> in fact, the Middle East is extremely complicated. In fact, it's so complicated that me explaining it here tonight could possibly make it worse. <laughs> no, you won't. No, you won't. We'll have a punt, why not? Fuck it. The point is... Come on, come on, do it, do I it. I mean, basically, it's basically all you really need to know, Jane, is the people who live there don't really get on, right? And for my money, they should all pull their heads in. Oh, what did you say? Don't really get along? Yeah, we don't. Yeah. <laughs> we'll have a punt, yeah. why not? Fuck it. The point is... <laughs> I mean, basically, it's basically all you really need to know, Jane, is the people who live there don't really get on, right? And get on. For my money, should pull their heads in. Right? Pull your heads in, fellas. Calm down! Yeah, that's my advice. I'm in the Israelis. I don't like the people at the end of my road, but I haven't bought a tank. Hey! <laughs> I don't like the people who are around. bought a tank, you've got to use it, anyway. That's where all the problems arise. <laughs> and a while ago, we the British. Okay, <laughs> he mentioned the Middle East right now. I but wish he could elaborate. It's actually, more. yeah, it's actually uh, the United Kingdom, the British Empire. Um, they partitioned this area. Yeah, they did yeah, they what did. they did, you know. And uh, <laughs> yeah, I, I no, it's okay. It's complicated. One. Like you put you 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 that okay. A number of people are living in this area, and then you came and ch -ch -ch -ch, straight lines, yeah. random straight lines, and a bunch of different people are living here, you know. Yeah. And I want people to know that, okay. Yeah. It is complicated, but at the same time, it was. Uh, Intended, uh, maybe? It, I don't know if it was intended. It's politics, and I hate politics. Of yeah. course, the intention of politics, in my opinion, is always um, to for create evil, game. not for, for mm. the good of people. Mm. Um, yeah. I say that... Okay, yeah, there's a lot of different people that, that are living here. You know, we are Christians, we're living with Muslims, and we don't always agree, so... Yeah, as he, as he said, it's complicated, you know? Yeah. You can't put... Like in Lebanon, there are 18 sects, you know, and the country is built on sectarianism. So, of course, there's going to be problems all the time. Before we called it Lebanon and Syria and, and everything else, and you know, people were living and they were living like away from each other. But then the lines came and then the borders and then the countries and we were like pushed to live with each other, yeah. you know? And that created all the conflict here and the in, chaos the, and everything. in the Middle East, in, yeah. in all of the Middle East, you know? like. I mean, he's joking about it, but it's a reality that yeah. we're living here, we are suffering. I really want to hear oh. his opinion on I it. I wish he could elaborate. I don't know if he would, but yeah, we'll have to figure Let's it out. See, yeah. Yeah. I just wanted to make this clear, so. Yeah, hit play, man. <laughs> I use it, anyway, that's where all the problems arise. And a while ago, 
We, the British, very helpfully stepped in to try and sort out the Middle East once and for all. We did. We did. We made an effort you did. Yeah, on our way through to India to get a cup. Made... And we... Yeah, they went... <laughs> They wanted to Sam go to down, India. back of an envelope, red pen and a ruler, and we drew them some nice new straight borders yeah, around the naturally occurring oil that we had found that they weren't looking for. And, <laughs> and we set them up with kings and queens in Arab countries with beautiful Arab names like Syria and Iraq and Jordan and Saudi Arabia. Yeah, I mean, we could have just called them Shell, S-O, BP, <laughs> Texaco, Wild Bean Cafe, but no! <laughs> Iraq, it's ours now. There's Iran, who's next. There's Afghanistan, work in progress. There's uh, <laughs> Pakistan, who need to get their house in order. And then, of course, India, or 118 India, as I prefer to call it. <laughs> Basically, the Geordies asked for too much money. <laughs> <laughs> what they were... <laughs> well, they were going to spend a pound a week, and I can't imagine. Here we have... But India... It's a land of ancient, mysterious, mystic, ancient mystery, an ancient, mysterious, mystic land locked within an ancient, mysterious, mystic tradition of ancient, mysterious, mystic mystery, wrapped within the Say that again. <laughs> in a nutshell. <laughs> OK. With Fair four enough. billion people that we used to run with two boats and a bike. Okay. Now, <laughs> how we got away with that, I can't imagine. That's the actual mystery. Here you work your way around, there's the dangling <laughs> genitals of Southeast Asia. As you, <laughs> can see. you see that there? And the dangling genitals. <laughs> Filthy. Fantastic. There's uh, Vietnam, the left bollock, Cambodia, the right bollock. <laughs> Malaysia, the Belen, Singapore. The bollock. There's uh, <laughs> Christmas Island, where it is Christmas every day. Someone should tell Wizard and they can fucking knock it off. There's uh, <laughs> Indonesia, Papa's got a brand new Guinea. There's Australia. <laughs> or Wilkinson Land, as I prefer to call it. Here we have New Zealand, yeah. Down yeah, under. New Zealand, yeah, of course. <laughs> Land of ancient hobbits and orcs. Hey, yeah, yeah, you like the hobbits, oh, don't you, Andrew? They're about the right height, aren't they, pal? <laughs> you have definitely thought about it. It's all you can think about. Yeah, You're, they... You are obsessed, mate. That's all you oh. can think about all the time. Oh, you can't get out of your head. Now, up here, of course, we have uh, Hawaii, where Pearl Harbor is, as everyone knows. As everyone yeah. knows, where the Americans were taken completely by surprise. Two oh. years into a global war. <laughs> <laughs> You're amateurs, mate. Now, yeah. trop Tropic of Cancer, they should change that. It's tasteless. Um, it's <laughs> that setting for the relatives. There's Easter Island, of course, where the there's lots of chocolate. The Galapagos, where we invented evolution. Down here. Well, you, you look at every island. South Pole. Now, everyone knows that the British were we actually invented second evolution. to the South Pole. That's a fact. I'm not afraid of getting that. But because we got there second, we were able to verify that the other bloke got there first. Which means, strictly speaking, we're the umpire on that one. Therefore, it's our game, our rules, we win. Can't argue that. <laughs> Can't argue that. <laughs> Falkland Islands, 1982, no help from no one else, eh? Fantastic. And that wasn't a war for oil, either. That was a war for penguins, which, of course, are an essential ingredient penguins. in making Guinness. You boil them up, the white stuff oh. floats to the top. There's, uh, <laughs> Oh my god, man. Glad that you come up with that. Chili, which is stringy. Up here we have Peru. Has anyone here been to Peru? Anyone at all? Yeah, a few, a couple of people been to Peru. Yeah, the lady there, what's your name, love? Laura. Laura. Posh. Now, you went, Posh. what was Peru like, love? <laughs> Beautiful. Well, I'll tell you what, I'm never going there, sweetheart. And I urge none of you Why? to go there, and I urge none of you to have anything to do with Peru, right? Because that country might be beautiful, love, but it's bang out of order. I'm no bleeding heart, you've detected that by now, but the way they treat their bears is a fucking outrage. <laughs> the way they treat their what? The why? Bears? bears? I don't know why. The way they take a bear when he's not even fully grown, they give him a suitcase and a scruffy old hat and a scruffy old coat. They give him his travel documents and note, please look after this bear, not even so his fucking name is. <laughs> Send him off on his way, eh? It's an outrage. What? <laughs> I didn't get that. Yeah, Coming over too. here, eating our marmalade sandwiches. There's that. Uh... <laughs> oh, yeah. There's Colombia, where excitement's from. There's uh... <laughs> Venezuela, capital city, Caracas. <laughs> Grow up. Yeah. Grow up. Panama, one canal. I'm not impressed. We've got thousands, don't we? <laughs> <laughs> He's and ours will lead to Great Britain. No, they're not the arse end of fucking nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> There's no the cricketing one. area, not what Argentina? it was. There's um, Mexico, capital city, Mexico City. Make an effort! <laughs> Make an effort? <laughs> <laughs> he 
He skipped Argentina and Brazil. And of course, the United States of America, which is basically the best way of looking at it, really, is that it's a good idea that's got out of hand. <laughs> I mean, they've lost the plot, these people. Look, you can't call a town Tampa. It's going to confuse the ladies. <laughs> and they got off to a good start. New England, you can see what they're trying to do there. I mean, you've got, you've got Norfolk, Durham, they were Richmond, trying to Birmingham, make you. <laughs> New England, Newark, Hartford, <laughs> Manchester. Yeah, they're starting to run out of sensible names, aren't they? Sit, <laughs> bang up, Welsh name alert. They're in the shit. I mean, then they go mad. Chattanooga, Tennessee, Albuquerque. It's not. not you're not playing yeah. fucking Scrabble, fellas. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, he actually he got a Up point. Here, of course, it's Canada. Now, these people in this part of Canada are absolutely. Com <laughs> this is priceless. These, <laughs> <laughs> these people in this part of Canada are absolutely convinced that they're French. <laughs> they're French. <laughs> <laughs> <They're French. laughs> That's not the case. The They're just living shit, and yeah. it's a reflex action. Peace <laughs> 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 out. <laughs> Baffin Island without a baffin on it. Greenland, which is white. Iceland, which is a volcano. The Faroe Islands, nowhere near Egypt. I never get that, yeah. <laughs> and back here. <laughs> and back here, of course, Unbelievable. Great, That's one of the most beautiful things about the world being round. The way the British God made it for us. <laughs> British God. British God. <laughs> because God is British, that's why we don't have earthquakes in this country. <laughs> you don't shit on your own doorstep. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> exactly. About the world being round is whichever way you go, you'll always end up back here in Great Britain, here in Her Majesty's London, on a Sunday night, drinking the Bloomsbury Theatre with people like you. Yeah? <laughs> on the GMT, on the GMT. <laughs> oh man. Wow. Oh my god. <laughs> I forgot I was filming. You really forgot? <laughs> you enjoy it? Yeah. That, wow. one, that can only mean that you enjoyed it. Yeah, like 23 minutes that went oh. by like yeah. swiftly. That was um, quick and, wow. uh, and full. Full. Yeah. Full of info. Actually, there are some references I didn't know about. Did you? Like, yeah, me too. And... Yeah, he made he made a little uh, things about England. He made yeah. he made the facts that he did, he said sound uh, comic and uh, funny. You know, like you can really get educated after a a, yeah. a video like this. You he's know? actually a historian, so he's very you know educated and yeah, no clever. Wonder. And mm -hmm. you can learn new things from his you know comedy skits. That's what yeah. that's what I like. Yeah. What caught my attention when he pointed to the US, like yeah. the way because they went from here and they discovered it like you know from right to left. Yeah, true. They started with or English names and then they. Um. Switch to other Makes like uh, maybe or the uh, native Indians, you know. Yeah, like San Diego or, or uh, California, like yeah, or Latin uh, or American, yeah. you know, or more yeah, American. Maybe. Yeah, they got Makes a different sense. culture there, yeah. you know, and they named it differently. Yeah, he got a point, and uh, yeah, I didn't notice that before, but. I wish he talked about the Middle East a little more. Like he's know? not gonna elaborate, you know. It's yeah, I know, a, a I know, comedy. but I really enjoy his videos, so I want him to like talk more. And I find myself like, like you mentioned, like you forget that you're filming and everything, you know. Like mm -hmm. you enjoy the moment and you enjoy the video. You enjoy what he's talking about. You can feel a different thing in his uh, comedy skits. Like yeah. he he adds uh, something, you know, educational in his comedy, yes. unlike others, like you can listen to a joke, you can... Uh, yeah, you can laugh, can, you can yeah, enjoy you can your laugh, time. But, but he, he makes enjoy you your think, time and he, he you makes know? you think, yeah. Especially in the other, the first two we reacted to. Yeah, he um, brought, he brought, he even brought a big globe, you know, to talk, <laughs> about, holding... to talk about every country <laughs> yeah. in the world. And yeah, he, yeah, he's not holding the beard this he's time. He's massive. not uh, the pub landlord. So. Yeah, her hand, <laughs> his hands were... Occupied, you know, with the globe. <laughs> I couldn't drink yeah. beer. <laughs> I actually have other recommendations of him. We can check them out. We will definitely check them um, out. Yeah, I truly Man. enjoyed it. Yeah, me too. Me too. Um, Man, this video will take forever <laughs> unless we wrap it up. <laughs> and now we're gonna have to wrap it up. For any recommendation, make sure to drop down a comment below and don't forget to like the video. And of course, our journeys and Murray will definitely continue. So stay tuned for more. <laughs>